Greedy ass company, bro. Greedy ass fucking pigs, bro. Greedy as slimy motherfuckers who created this dumbass booster, bro. In fact, I actually wrote a little bit of a poem. A haiku, you might say. Now allow me to begin. Nexon's greedy snout. Feast on Soul Erda's bounty. Players cries a shout. Wow. How moving that was. Clearly describes how much of a fucking pig Nexon is. Feasting on us. Feasting on us. Just like how we want our soul Erda. And players cries a shout. But nothing can be heard. So. Fuck this game bro. What can I say? If you guys have no idea what I'm talking about. Let me show you. So. Maple Story C. Their patch notes just came out. C is Maple Story Southeast Asia. And for those who don't know, MapleStory C and GMS are good friends. We usually get the same things. So seeing this booster that they made is pretty much confirmed that we're going to get it as well. But I still think that we should still argue and hope that it gets reverted or buffed or something. Literally anything changes. <sighs> Rival of New Age, Soul Erda, blah, 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 blah. They make a Soul Erda booster. Wow. Activates the Sword of Booster for 30 days. Once used in the game, can be obtained using the Sword of Booster. This item can be available, you know, it's available for like 30 days and it costs around $30 USD dollars to get this. Sword of Booster can be purchased once per world per 30 days. Don't even think about making a second main. Don't even think about it, dumbass. Don't even think about it. I don't know why you thought about it. You're a fucking idiot for thinking about it. Sir, Soul Urda Booster could be purchased again after 30 days. Okay, so like, you know, after 30 days, you're going to have to buy another one. Cough it up, piggy. Cough it up. Give me another $30. Hand it over, bro. Sir Urda Booster. I can't read. Cannot be purchased while Sir Soul Urda Booster effect is active within the world. Yeah, obviously, you're not going to buy it on another character. Only characters above level 260. And if you want to use it, you literally just double click it. It opens up this window and you get a daily reward of one soul Erda and four fragments. Wow. Oh, that's crazy. That's a lot, isn't it? Huh? Oh, my God. And after you do the daily for six days, you get the grand surprise super bonus. Wow. You get to choose either two soul or soul Erdas or 20 fragments. They don't even give you both, bro. These dumbasses at Nexon think that like. Bro, they be acting like they grinded this themselves, bro. They're like, here, I guess you can have a little bit, I guess. When they're actually slimy pigs and can just spawn it in, bro. It's crazy. Additional special rewards are available when the daily reward were claimed six times. Select either 2x. Yeah, exactly. Can only be claimed once per day. Only characters level 260 or higher. And you can't be used if you have more than 20 soul order. So, for those who don't know... And for those who like don't realize how garbage this is, let me tell you. So you're going to have to basically buy this like 15 times. You're basically going to have to buy this like 15 times to max out. So instead of it taking around like a little less than two years to max, it's only going to take around 15 months now. So, you know, what a huge deal. What a huge deal. And on top of that, it's going to cost you around... A little almost five hundred dollars just to get like a little bit more boost to max your soul erda just a little bit faster which is crazy are you willing to spend almost five hundred dollars just to max your soul erda a little bit faster because i'm not fuck that and you know obviously a lot of people are like but, uh, uh, but uh, i gotta i gotta hit rank one uh, i gotta get my advantage i gotta get whatever advantage i can right Dude, it literally doesn't even matter. It's not even worth it, bro. I'm telling you, it's not worth it. I know that no matter what I say, there's still going to be rats who are going to buy this and try to get some sort of advantage regardless. But, I, I mean, I guess so, bro. I guess you, you're you willing to you're willing to make that choice. What am I going to do? But it, it's not worth it, bro. Like, th this is actually so terrible for the game. It's so terrible. Like, even the way they implemented it. Let, let's, say, let's say I throw an X on a bone here. And they actually did want to do a booster. Even the way they implemented it is so trash, bro. Like, you could have made a booster that released the cap, or you could have made a booster that um, 
actually made it so that you cap way faster and and then it also increases the cap or something like that like even the way they implemented it is so dog like it's crazy like not only are they gonna fuck us they don't even know how to fuck us properly you know what i mean like it's crazy like at, at, at fucking phone alarms going off bro like at least like i don't even know bro like i'm just i don't even know what to say bro i'm just speechless i'm just speechless and i know there's gonna be people i know there's gonna be people that are like oh why are you even surprised bro why are you even surprised bro like believe it or not like if you actually played this game the last like six years like me um things have been getting better year after year like actually like i know that's like a very like hard pill to swallow but if you look at the game like year to year like it does get a little bit better every year but this like just plummets it back down to like 20 feet under bro not even six feet under like it's crazy how garbage this is so yeah i'm not buying this hell no uh it's really sad because i was so hyped for new age like with the new server and six job and all this stuff like i was so hyped bro i was so 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 hyped and now it's just like back now it's like this game is just like how do i even describe it like the hype is gone and not only that it's worse it's just like dreadful you know what i mean it's just like dreadful now now it's just like every single person that i know thanks for the follow goat thanks for the follow every single person i know is just like pissed and demotivated like it's crazy like it's 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 just it's that simple bro it's that simple to just take away everything from us it's that simple bro it's that simple either way though i do think that we should still continue the hashtag don't spend and like you know causing an uproar talking on the forums talking everyone in the discord every every single possible avenue i do think that we should still complain because you know they could they could still change it in the future like i know it sounds really impossible but like we do gotta still complain like no matter what we just have to keep complaining over and over and over and over again because this is ridiculous like it really is ridiculous like i don't know i was watching jake and joe's video and joe was saying like i don't know a single company that prevents their players from like playing the game like that's literally all we want to do we want to play your stupid ass game and grind on it like like isn't that crazy like this legit stops us from grinding even more like isn't that what you want isn't that what you want from us like isn't that what you want you want us to like grind your game more and log in more like it's so weird like it just makes no sense i don't know who this benefits this doesn't benefit anybody like it's actually so weird weird ass pigs at nexon bro it's so weird like the sad thing is like i was so excited for like the new server and stuff like that i was planning to do like this massive massive event like for the start of like hyperion start streaming more do like big sub goals i was legit planning on giving away pets every single day like this massive like pet extravaganza but now i don't want to give a single dollar to this rat ass company so it's like i don't know man like it's so annoying it's so annoying bro like because on the new server with Hyperion, everybody's going to need pets, right? And I was planning to just give away pets every single day. And I'm not I'm not trying to say this to be like, look at me. Like, I was trying to be like a savior and like a saint to the maple world. Like, no, I just wanted to like, I, I just wanted to like try and help people out because it would be hype. And it would get more people to play on the server because they have a pet and, and whatnot. But like, now it's just like, bro, fuck this game, bro. Fuck this game. This doesn't mean that I'm going to quit. And I know a lot of people are going to be like, oh, but, but like the best way to show resistance is to quit. And you're not wrong, but I feel like I can, I still can just like make videos about the game uh, while also mentioning that this game is so dog and like they need to revert the soul order. Or when I go on stream, I could just talk about, um, I could just talk about how horrible it is so that every single new player, when they come into this game, they know how horrible it is. They know how horrible it is. Like, I feel like that'll also have an impact because at the end of the day, even if I quit or something in videos or something like that, there's still going to be somebody else who does those things. Like, there's still going to be somebody else who streams and makes those videos and stuff like that. And if they're not showing how horrible and like unjust this game is, then nobody's going to know about it. And eventually through time, people are just going to forget, right? But I feel like if I just keep making videos and I keep reminding everybody all the time how horrible and unjust this dog ass pig company is, then, you know, I did my part.
But, I mean, I don't really have anything to say. Uh, fuck this game, I guess. And fuck whoever decided that this would be a good idea or whatever team decided that this would be a good idea. Fucking pigs, bro. Like, actual pigs, bro. It's crazy.